A historic first in the district as people crowded in to see the cherry blossoms, a new group packed southeast to celebrate the Anacostia River neighborhood. As Diane Cho reports, D.C.'s newest tradition got off to a rocking start. As the sounds of the U.S. Navy ceremonial band trumpet throughout the park, children and families soaked in the rays, taking part in everything from the bike parade to the water activities for the first ever Anacostia River Festival. On the last day of the Cherry Blossom Festival. It is great. It, was, it beat my expectations. For others like Roberta Jackson, seeing the festival launch today brought more sentimental value. I came because my father grew up in D.C., in, in southeast D.C., and so to see all the work that's been done, the transformation, the beauty, the artwork, it's just an amazing thing. The event is supported by the 11th Street Bridge Park, not far from Anacostia Park, designed to connect Capitol Hill to its neighbors on the other side of the river. We, we could not be more blessed to have a city that sits on two sides of a river. And one of them should not be the stepchild river. It should be a river just as grand as the Potomac River, and that's what we're going to make the Anacostia River. Genevieve Tab Vasquez lives on Capitol Hill and came out to explore a new neighborhood. I'm kind of excited about the upcoming 11th Street Bridge project, so kind of wanting to see all of that, and the end of the cherry blossoms. Thousands of people back to park here for an event that organizers hope will continue to grow for years to come. In Southeast D.C., Diane Cho, ABC 7 News.